is Tuesday, <clears throat> May 17th, 2022. In my flat American voice, um, I went to the, the local school with my son. I was dropping him off, asked, today was the day I asked about the book fair because they're starting a book fair. Um, and as I was leaving, one of the other little boys that I've known, he's a standout for me. He has this effervescent spiritual personality. He's of the Asian community. Um, he sat with me before. He called me Disney Princess um, the last time he saw me uh, on that park bench. Um, but he and I, I always say, I said, oh, I said, you're going to work today with Dad as they walk to school. Um, and today he says, oh, you again. He says, you are everywhere. And I said, yes, I said, I am. I said, I'm like mother of nature. I am just everywhere. And I smiled and I waited for them to pass. Um, and he said, no, he says, you are like the blue fairy from Pinocchio. And I said, that, I mean, my heart elated. I mean, I was so grateful and thankful for his, um, compliment I thought it was, it was, it, I mean, it, it was very heart touching. Um, so for me, I was grateful and thankful and I thanked him and I said, enjoy your day. I came home, I told Linda and Lou, and then I decided, you know, I don't even remember a blue fairy in Pinocchio. It's been so many years since I've seen it. So I went to the most reason, I went to the queue on the digital component that they allow in the house um, to see and they've redone it. it uh, when I saw it, it was a Disney World cartoon. Now they actually have a remake with real live people in it. And I, my grandfather was obsessed with Pinocchio. I do not know why. But it's the wooden puppet. Uh, my grandfather, by the way, after I watched the trailer first, um, was dressed much better but for this level of humanity in the fallout shelter. Uh, when he arrived. Um, he always wore a jacket and a pair of suit pants. Uh, it's just this area did not call for um, a shirt and tie, but he always had a button-down shirt uh, as well in white. Um, sometimes he went with whatever, but for the most part it was white, button-down. Um, Alright, so this is the Pinocchio and it has a date of 2019 and this is the trailer this is the trailer that they gave me between Gepetto, Gepetto's puppet creation Pinocchio uh, magically comes to life with dreams of becoming a real boy easily led astray Pinocchio tumbles from one misadventure to the next it has so much parallel with Lewis And it's from Lionsgate. I've been thinking to make with my hands by myself a wooden... My grandfather was a craftsman. He was a skilled craftsman. He could make anything out of wood. He could make anything, I mean, duct tape and a bike handle. And he was now a plumber. I mean, like, there was nothing this... I mean, he could engineer things. I was always in such amazement of the things he put together. He made his own glue. I mean, things that... Lewis, I don't know if he knows anymore. I know I can't translate for my children. I can't even remember. And he used to, in the house, after Angelina died, he would make fresh ravioli. He would make pasta from scratch with one of the pasta machines. I mean, and he made his own bread. The man was a, a marvel. He really was a marvel. <laughs> Pinocchio, shall I say something? Babbo. I have a son. My son is born. From one day to the next. What do you mean from one day? From one minute to the next. Watch me, eh? And one and two. If you do like me, in two or three days, you'll be walking by your... Pinocchio! He's a puppet like us. Who are you? Pinocchio. Ah, I know a certain place called the Field of Miracles. 
put them in prison! Oh, call me prison! I find it interesting the birds on the wooden nose picking at it. Well, Pinocchio just sits there. And where is the blue fairy in the secret garden? Just curious. Now there is this movie that they also put up, Charlotte Grey. A Scotswoman joins French resistance fighters in order to rescue her lover during World War II. Um, again, these movies were put out there. I don't know if they painted the wrong portrait in the unrest in the American colonies, considering that there's some, there's some mention of a French and Indian war in these papers they just gave. Now, this is with Warner Brothers. These are big names. Then there's Universal, there's Century 20, there's, now I found out yesterday, there's Mir A Max. Oh my god, the Mir station to the maximum in the A? Get out of town. Where would they come up with a name like that? I mean... Remember who you are not. Identity card? Russian card. From the moment you leave the ground, you are Dominique Gilbert from Paris. Certificate of non-belonging to the Jewish race. You simply want to survive the war. Fiddles. Done. From this moment on, Charlotte Grey. Cyanide pill. Is dead. Welcome to France, Dominique. You're not from around here? Paris. She's dead. I am RH negative. I am what the next movie in the exception between the officer of a different label, of different pronoun. See, I am a verb. I have not pronounced and I don't do nouns. So I am a verb. I have verb things need to get done with another verb. He has not announced what his noun is, so I may not pronounce it. On my side, Irish Gala. For your country. Nobody fights for their country. They fight for someone they love. Did your best! Don't say that! You don't know what I've done. 
Now here's one. It's called Black Book from 2006. It says during World War II, a member, Hutan, of the Jewish resistance, but spelled Jew, J-E-W-I-S-H, not Janvier to Juvier, different, because that's J-U-V-I-E-R for VIA! For anything Norwegian or Scandinavian. Um, she was ordered to seduce. And this is so New York. Sony. Your first time? Rachel Stein? That is like every time I've walked into the hall of the expose in the conference where I walk in expecting the verb I was built for and instead I get a lot of nouns that I don't learn their names because why would I want to know all the nouns? If I have a trouble pronouncing them, it's probably in their favor. But they know who they are and they gather however they do. Hoe ver zijn we er begaan? Ik bedoel net hem naar bed. Alice? We moeten ons steen boven. Now in 2002, they made this movie, Fortress, Sniper's Eye. When Paul's wife Melissa is abducted, he and his father embark on a deadly journey through rugged mountains in hopes of saving her before time runs out. They have this little tricky thing in the Kaiser. Not the ones the American show, but the real one. Where you're not allowed to speak to him directly. There is a movie they also put out called The Exception. That will be what I end on. They say life could be understood backwards. But This is our timeline. Because some humans live in the future and plan the backwards. While others are living through the backwards into this unbeknownst future event. It must be lived forward. That's right. These are the two idiots they have me in America with. 1975 and 1976, arguing with each other. Ricky? Ricky, where you at? What's wrong? Yeah, I'm coming back. Here we are. Old friend. Together again. Yeah, I'm coming back. The fortress. Dying husk of its former self. It's 
think the same about you. Yeah, I'm coming. What do you want, Bozari? Today's game is six hundred million in cold hard cash. This again? It's gone. <laughs> Are you saying I'm driven by revenge? I am. Who are these people? They're just after money. The best way to hurt you is to destroy every little thing you love. Do your worst. Madrice, would you please give my friend here a hand? Rise from the ashes. I must make you suffer. Let everyone go. Where are you? Rise from the ashes. Here's the last one. It's called the exception, and then it goes to the goot, which is the G O T. Game of Thrones, which they also put out, but that started in 2011 uh, at Winterfell. That's how it begins. I mean a winter term with the DMX Rough Riders and the mayor. It says the exception. During, it came out in 2016, right around the time that I had a, I, I entered some world of hurt realm that the humans provided. It says, during World War II, a soldier travels to a secluded mansion to investigate a mysterious German monarch. He soon finds himself entangled in a web of deceit while having a dangerous love affair with a local Jewish woman, Lily James. You have beautiful hands. You are quite unused to... Physical labor, no? War changes everything. The Kaiser remains of great symbolic importance to the German people. You will address him as sir, and you will speak only when spoken to, and all discussion of politics is forbidden. You are to take immediate command of his military guard. The British Secret Service have an agent in the area. It could be a kidnap attempt, most likely an assassination. If anything happens to him, Captain, you'll be shot. Captain, there's a British spy after me. You'll be quite safe, Your Highness. My name is Stefan. I was wondering what yours was. Me, Katia. Now, was the British spy after he or after Lewis and myself? I'm just curious at verbs without pronouns. Pronouns being a person, place, or thing. Female staff are not to be interfered with. The old man is getting a visit tomorrow from the head of the SS. El Hitler. It seems we are to go back to Berlin. Can that be true? You are to be king again? I'm Jewish. I don't care. One day you might have to. Now by Jewish in German, German first. Lowborn. Is that what she means? I'm just curious. Because the pageants and peasantry would lead one to believe that that's a correct, accurate fact, except in the wide world of misconstrued baby formula. And how does one feed one's own petit, mon petit, if one is mon droit? another transmission last night. The Gestapo would be making a thorough search of the house. The SS murdered my father. I think we should keep this to ourselves. Now do they mean the SS by Lewis and this... But they allowed this Pinocchio movie to try to explain what the Americans have done. I'm just curious. While this US looks over and makes everything worse. So far, that's how the story in my real area has gone. I'll protect you. Are you serious? Be careful. Nobody is safe. Can you not 
officer have a loyalty to anything greater than his country? Marry me, Mika. No. This was 1997 on Hofstra's campus, however that worked, when Ian was there and gave me the honor certificate and I went home to the dorm room with the person that was not invited to the honor certificate. The person I loved, the person I wanted to marry, the really tall one I was waiting for at the crazy donkey when Ro showed up and the tall handsome one I wanted did not. And then I went home, got on the phone, it should be in archive. And then I went straight to him where I wanted to be the whole night. I never wanted to leave his side. I also did not want to leave, I did not want him to leave solo without me here. But it seems that he and I have not gotten our way. Dave. I was going to turn you over to the Gestapo. Mika, trust me. Yeah. And then they came out with a series which I watched it but not with a keen eye because I'm lost in this nothingness. Um, in from 2011 to 2019, it's this Game of Thrones which they have labeled as Gut G O T. It says George R R Martin best-selling book series A Song of Ice and Fire is brought to the screen as H. B.O. sinks its considerable storytelling teeth into the medieval fan fantasy epic. It's the depiction of two powerful families, kings and queens, knights and renegades, liars and honest men, playing a deadly game for control of the seven kingdoms of Westeros. And two, and then it goes to dot, dot, dot. It's star 1978, star 8378, Nicole Cataruza. It's Earth, Solar System, Milky Way Universe, Galaxy is Broken. And it's Bayside Station, Bayside, New York, 11361. And the way that the real world works is the beginning of Sniper's Eye movie. That's where bits and pieces of I got stung and then I go down and I don't know what happened. And I don't know what they do with my body while I am down in this New York. So how is that supposed to go? I'm just curious at somebody who actually loves another. It's May 17th, 2022.